Hey, what's up guys? Danny Colville here at Colville Outfitters and Custom Tackle. Um, sorry about not getting back to everybody. We've been super busy over here. Finally starting to catch our breath. Might be able to do some fishing here pretty soon. Uh, I have a bunch of people who are looking for reels, so I wanted to show you guys what's available and then uh, show you some other stuff that I'm working on. And um, and yeah, that should do it. So anyways, I hope you guys are doing great. I hope you're getting out there, getting lots of shiny fish and uh, staying safe, happy, healthy. All right, so let's get started here, guys. All right, so as you know, we're doing our new 565s right now. So this is, it's a little smaller than the six inches, obviously. So uh, this one is a drop back, all gunmetal with rogue red accents, red crushed ice handles. They all have a dome back plate with, um, some have porting, some don't. This one has one row of teardrops. This artwork is a Trevor Hawkins Sequoia and it's got the uh, crushed red ice handles and clicker knob inlay. That is a six inch Pacific Drifter, purple and black. I have a seamstress here in steelhead blue. And this is the Mitten State series, which is our Michigan series. And again, that's 5.65 inches. This is a three row of circular porting on the dome back plate, crushed black ice handles and clicker knob inlay spin reaper artwork by Ryan Orndorf. If you're looking for some more budget friendly reels, we do have one silver and purple boulder. We have a couple fjords. I do have a bronze boulder back there. I do have a constellation steelhead blue and bogus shell bronze. I have a blue on blue Delta 5.65. So this is the Deschutes blue. It's got the cloud blue handles on it with the Usneel Santos worm eater artwork. We have a rogue red and ghost silver winter run with pearl handles. This one has the winter run artwork on the back by Trevor Hawkins. Really beautiful reel. If you're looking for a five inch, I got a silver on silver Lotus or I have a military green constellation. We call this Pacific Northwest Pine. It's got the rogue gold accents, carbon fiber backplate. What's up, Mr. Rahole? I do have this one also available. This is uh, Blurple with orange splash on it. Thank you, Marcus. Appreciate it, buddy. Hopefully, uh, I'll have a West Coast fishing video here for you. I got all the footage. Just have to put it all together. This is a seamstress otolith with a blue galaxy. One row of porting. And I'll show you a reel that isn't for sale, but it's probably one of the coolest fishing reels ever made. What's up, Mike? So this is a Sequoia 565. It's got the honeycomb, uh, honeycomb handles and center cap. And boom. Check that out, guys. Have you ever seen a reel that's cooler than that? I don't know. I haven't. Check that thing out. That's a showstopper for sure. All right, what else do we got for you guys? We brought back the Dream Catchers for the 5.65 inch. So we have a Deschutes Blue, 
and silver ghost silver dream catcher here and on the back we have the the dripping steel artwork it's one of the new ones from trevor hawkins And these are all six inch reels guys so if you're looking for a six inch we do have actually a decent amount of them in stock surprisingly if you're looking for an affordable reel we do have a really nice delta 750 here and this is the one i wanted to show you guys this one is a Silver on silver winter run with no porting. These are our lightest reels we've ever made, these winter runs and some of the other models. But uh, it's got the hard coat emerald accents. What's up, Josh Poppy? How you doing, baby? Hey, Juan. Okay, I'll try to slide this case open without causing an avalanche. I got Bruce Kowalski with Tar Fishing here helping me today. We're working on a website actually, so he's getting some photos of the reels, so hopefully you guys can see a live inventory all the time. All right, so as you can see, we got some six inch reels. We do have one winter run. This is the first one I've ever seen like this. And uh, you guys could also see out of all these reels, the 100 or 150 reels I have, there isn't one that's exactly the same in the whole case or even remotely close. So they are all one of a kind. They are all unique and they fish better than they look. So. Um, so anyways back to it. This is a bronze on bronze winter run with the lava acrylic handles It's got the Santos Sequoia artwork with one row of circular ports and gunmetal accents Really beautiful reel we do have a few of these trichromes I know you guys love them and this is the first that anyone's hearing about it, but we're doing a limited batch of 5.65 inch trichromes so those are prepped we have to polish them um, but the spools are machined uh, we are going to be working on those in the next few weeks so those are going to be coming you can put your orders in there's only eight trichromes in the 5.65 inch size all right guys let's get to what we have brand new that no one's ever seen before All right, let's see here. All right, here is a new one. Bruce is trying to help me. Thank you, Bruce. Okay, this is a 5.65 inch drop back with the pearl gray and white acrylic accents and this is a trevor hawkins michigan series and if you can notice we uh we made the michigan the upper and lower peninsula we made it more vibrant so it really went with the whole theme and uh, those are all the rivers in michigan unfortunately the way the artwork set up there's a few in the corner here that got covered but the pure marquette is just above the clicker so it you could see it right there that isn't covered thank god because that's such a majestic river but yeah that one is available all right what do we got next here sorry for the bad camera work my friend derek zybach sent a tripod and a phone holder i haven't had a chance to set it up yet but big shout out to derek thanks for sending that over buddy so this is kyle rittenhouse kyle your reel's all set ready to go i'm gonna spool this and ship this out to you but that's a uh, bow branches with a single row of holes bronze and blue straight knockout is there some components in there yeah check these out and look at and look at these components guys I had to throw these in extra just because they went so damn good, but 
That's a voodoo acrylic resin. So Kyle's getting a special pre-order treat here. There you go, Brucey. And if you guys, uh, why Bruce is here, I might as well give him a shout out on his rods and stuff. If you guys haven't seen the new 13 foot tar rods, if you're in the West Coast, these things, or if you're in Michigan, West Coast or Michigan, there's not many rods that are a better value than these. These are 13 foot, eight to 16 pound. They got a beautiful handle. It's this cork handle right in the middle here with a really nice reel seat. Super quality cork, good buck cap on it. Really is phenomenal. As you guys know, I love the three to six or the two to six pound that he has, the 12 footer. It's an awesome Erie Trib rod. But this one, I'm telling you guys, for Michigan or for the West Coast, you will not be disappointed. And Bruce is a veteran, so when you buy one of his rods, you're also supporting uh, someone who served our country. So check him out. It's tarfishing.com, T-A-A-R fishing.com. All right, back to the reels. Okay, you guys haven't seen this yet. This is the, we call these Fjord Bad Fish because it looks like the Bad Fish cover on the Sublime album. Um... They're also known as a Fjord 5, but there's no uh, extra finger tabs that we screw in. These are actually, they have the finger tabs, but we machined them out of metal. It's really cool looking. Super solid reel. So this is going to my buddy Will in Oregon. This is the Orndorff Tribal Artwork with a tortoise shell inlay. Real beautiful. I'll just throw them in there when we're done. So. Did that one, I think. And we are looking for a bigger place, so eventually I'm going to be a little bit more organized with everything. I know organization isn't my best uh, characteristic, but... So this is a Delta. This one is a 5.65 inch. So the 5.65 inch, guys, if you need something for... The West Coast, British Columbia, Niagara River, or Michigan, of course, this is the reel for you, unless you want a six inch. So uh, it's got the Santo Sequoia on the back, and this is a Pacific Northwest Pine, and it's got the uh, yellow and green acrylic on there. What's up, Jimmy? All right, whose is this now? This is Scott Beck's. All right, Scott, here is your red and black acid-washed seamstress with a black backplate and the Trevor Hawkins seamstress artwork. Okay, next up here we got... Greg Topak. So Greg already knows this is coming. I got to get it spooled up. I've been real busy, guys, so bear with me here. This is a 50-50 matte-to-gloss finished spool with the abalone handles. Steelhead blue spool. Gunmetal backplate with a Trevor Hawkins flagfish. We got a real stunner over here. This one is available right here. This is a winter run silver spool with a turquoise back or Kalama Aqua. That's the other name for that color. And it's got the abalone inlay, abalone handles, and abalone center cap. Real beautiful reel, guys. And the Usenil Santos bow branches. This one should go really, really fast. This one is a silver seamstress 565 with a spin reaper artwork on the backplate with three rows of circular porting, gunmetal backplate, ghost silver spool. Absolute killer. Cru uh, black crushed ice handles and inlay. Kyle's again. Check this one out. What's up, Keenan? Hey, Eric. Yours is coming, buddy. 
thank you guys for all being patient. I'm hounding these anodizers, but they are just, uh, they got life going on. So family issues and, you know, one guy's taking care of a sick, uh, sick relative. So doing the best we can, but, uh, we do have some reels for you. If you want to swap out what you ordered, we could do that as well. But this is a Dreamcatcher 565 Rogue Red Spool Black Accents. And then we got this beautiful black and red acid wash back plate with a crushed red ice inlay and handles. This one is also available. This is a one of our new 565s called the Hydra. And it's got uh, abalone handles, ghost silver spool and back plate. And it's got the Ryan Orndorf Tribal Trout. Now, I don't know if this one is for sale yet because uh, I think I might have needed a spool for someone, but I have to double check. But this is the new Tamarack. So it's uh, kind of a cousin of the Sequoia where the Sequoia is a concave version of the Dreamcatcher. This is a concave version of the Shadow Drifter. And as you can see, that is absolutely killer. It's got the voodoo resin handles, center cap. It's got the seamstress artwork on the back. And it's steelhead blue and rogue red. Absolutely killer. Like I said, don't know if this one is going to be available. I won't know till probably Monday. But this is a real stunner. Okay, here comes another one. This is very easy with Bruce being here. So, all right, guys, we have a... Um, seamstress, and this is the Olympic or not Olympic, uh, Oregon candy apple green with a black back plate and the Trevor Hawkins seamstress art. Black crushed ice handles, or I'm sorry, black crushed ice inlay, and just straight black handles. Now we got a Dreamcatcher 565 bronze backplate Pacific Northwest Pine Spool, cat eye handles, non-ported backplate with the Michigan etching on the back. And as you can see, the Michigan is Michigan Upper and Lower Peninsula is more vibrant than the rest of the reel. Just just an absolutely stunner of a piece of artwork. Our artists really are amazing. I mean, this stuff is worth every penny. I almost feel like we get too good of a deal on it, but I couldn't afford to pay much more than what I pay, but it is a great value to be able to own this artwork to put on the back of your guys' reels. I got this dream catcher, which is a Oregon candy apple green spool and back plate with the seamstress artwork on the back with the green and yellow acrylic no ported with the seamstress art okay up next boys we got a burnt tangerine spool with a oregon candy apple green back plate and they call this acrylic something like screened I can't forget what it's I, I can't remember what it's called but it's called screen something but it's really super cool almost looks like there's seeds inside of it that's a real beauty I got a purple on purple drop back 565 with abalone handles one row of teardrop porting with gunmetal accents and an abalone inlay Usneel Santos Sequoia artwork. And for whatever reason, this one does not have a textured rim. So, pretty interesting. All right, what's up next here? We have our new, this is our new hot pink color. So uh, we haven't quite named this yet. We used to have, we still do have that salmon pink, but I think I'm going to discontinue it for this hot pink. I don't know what we're going to call it yet, but we will figure out some sort of cool name. Oh, no, this one, this, this pink was called Cheeky Pink. So it's like 
the pink that's on a steelhead's cheek that was the name of this i forgot so yeah this is the first one that's hit the shelf and this one this color is called cheeky pink and uh it's got a gunmetal back plate with the worm eater artwork and wow is that a just a killer reel this reel is beautiful but everyone on the river will remember you for your pink reel so uh remember that before you buy it i personally don't care i like having something a little more flashy but that's why we make some real classy reels like this one if you want to be a little bit more classic and original this is a bronze on bronze pier marquette drifter so the pier marquette drifter and the pacific drifter are essentially the same reel um, however, one, the Pacific Drifter is a 5.65 inch. This one is a, um, the Pacific Drifter is a 5.95. The Pure Marquette Drifter is a 5.65. It's got the three holes on the back plate, Pacific Northwest pine accents, cat eye inlays and handles, and the Usenil Santo Sequoia artwork. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, we're getting to the end here, guys. This one is a purple seamstress with purple denim handles, gunmetal backplate, Orndorff tribal trout, purple denim inlay, three rows of porting. And last but not least, look at this gem gunmetal on gunmetal dream catcher with pearl white handles. I want to see if I could pick up any of that other color. Well, I'll take my word for it. These videos never do these reels justice. Take a look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Seamstress artwork. So all gunmetal, silver accents, pearl, inlay, center, and handles. So that's a beautiful reel, guys. First come, first serve. When I, when I turn this video off... Let me know what's going on because I know my phone's about to blow up. If you want one of these, you could get a hold of us at the shop at 716-627-7335. Or you could also shoot us an email at colvilleoutfitters at gmail.com. Or you could uh, get a hold of me on Facebook or one of the other methods. I want to show you guys some really beautiful floats that we do have in stock right now. We just got in Superiors the last couple days. So, again, this is a first-come, first-serve on these floats. We have floats that are, I think we got some sixes and eights. Let's see. Yeah, this is an eight gram. Yeah, so we got sixes and eights, and then I got some slip floats that are... 28 grams and 16 grams uh and we have some pretty sweet um larger black tip floats as you guys can see in there so if you want some floats we're ready to rock and roll here somebody's calling i don't know if it's one of you crazy people but all right guys i love you hope you're being safe happy healthy and most of all fishy see you on the water